hello everyone this is Rahul in this video I'm gonna talk about UK immigration for work professionals and mainly I'm concerned about the IT professional as I am the techie and uh, okay so let's get started so first I'm gonna talk about the tier 2 general visa for which the Indians are very eligible and uh, so for tier 2 visa there are various things which uh, I mean there are various criteria which should be fulfilled uh, in order to get the visa sponsored so there are a couple of things so the very basic and very you know minimal thing which should be taken care of is the eligibility you should be knowing what uh, are you eligible or not so for that you need to get the sponsorship uh, I mean the uh, the sponsorship from the employer of the UK and second thing they should be paying you appropriate salary then you'll need to give the IELTS exam then uh, you'll have some savings which can say that you can support yourself in UK and uh, you'll need to show the five year history you need to have your TB test done in your country and uh, you need you'll need to have your criminal record certificate from your police and this is basically the website and as I think you can find the link on the URL tab and you can roam, roam around these, this website and you can check your eligibility and all okay so that's it for tie to visa I'll come up with a very explained video and very I mean prolonged video for this thing but uh, as um, uh, I'm running out of time so I'll continue with another section alright if you um, I'm just talking about the motivation for the UK uh, for the Indians to migrate to UK uh, sorry it's not the migration it's the immigration only and it's for work permit immigration we I'm not talking about the PR I'm not talking about the uh, whatever so called green card or permanent residency or citizenship I'm not talking about these I'm just talking about getting the job in UK so here is the most vital and most important thing the email alert subscription go to this tab and whether you are worried about UK visa or you are worried about getting job or remotely but make sure to create the subscription because anytime new amendment comes you will get to know on your email that okay what are the amendments and is it uh, is it good for me or not all right moving on to the next step we have got the apply for jobs this is the job this is a job portal I have found uh, I have found for the UK immigration and I thought that it's the very useful thing uh, for us I mean we can roam around this and we can basically search for uh, the job which you know which can be good for us and yeah for other options to f search for the job and search for the sponsorship employees uh, in the UK is uh, like uh, you can search on Glassdoor you can search on Indeed and uh, my favorite favorite one is job tactical so I'm roaming around job tacticals and there are lots of way uh, I mean there are lots of things on it you you can just roam around you can you'll find definitely you'll find something and okay then the next tab is latest documents so find this URL I I'll I'll mention it on YouTube channel okay so these are the latest documents as you can see there are it is written updated 18 June 2018 guidance UK VI so uh, they have amended something and they have got something new here so this is also the thing with uh, for which you guys should be updated in order to you know know what are the things going on after that I have got another tab and uh, that that tab is basically the UK sponsorship uh, I mean from UK immigration website itself so here we have got the plenty of employers which which basically offers tier 2 and tier 5 visas so there are around 29,052 employers and in which there are lots of uh, you know IT professional jobs IT professional employers out there and we have uh, as it is written tier 2 and tier 5 I'll tell you about the I'll tell you the difference between tier 2 and tier 5 so for tier 2 there are 27,000 uh, I mean employers over there in UK and for tier 5 uh, uh, 3800 so what does it mean it means you have got the tire to uh, I mean the employer from where from where I mean from 
whoever is giving you the job should must be there in this list because these I mean this list is saying you that these are the valid employees who are giving you the job and be aware of frauds okay and then uh, moving on to the next step here is uh, okay so if you are going through the tire to visa and if you are Indian so as we know India uh, English is not our primary language so if if someone is uh, from Canada or someone is from you know New Zealand or someone is from some other country they might not be giving the English proficiency test but here we will need to give the English proficiency test and for that you know if I just open this uh, I mean the test center if I talk about specifically talk about the Pune you know this is the Pune so in Pune uh, Bun Garden Road Camp Pune you can give the eyelids else test and uh, this is basically the English proficiency test and uh, I really don't know about how much uh, you know you how much the grade you should get in order to crack the tire to visa but yeah uh, in upcoming videos I'll come up with all these things moving on to the next step uh, we have got the tire 5 visa okay so tire 5 visa uh, 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 as I said I will be discussing about tire 5 visa so tire 5 visa is not for us tire 5 visa as it is written here you can apply for tire 5 visa youth mobility scheme visa if you are aged 18 to 30 and you are from Australia Canada Japan Monaco, New Zealand, Hong Kong, Republic of Korea and Taiwan so we haven't got our country listed here this means we are not eligible for Tire 5 visa and for Tire 5 visa they have got various things like British overseas citizens and so here we are uh, I can say we are less fortunate <laughs> that's why we are not getting these options for us 